computer. Okay, cool. Thanks. Hello? Yes. Yes, Hello? are we there? Okay, perfect. Okay, so we're going live now. All right. One, two, three. Okay. Let's All go. right, guys. And this is Chris on a wheel tour with Berkshire Hathaway, Texas Realty. I'm with co-host uh, Jose Puebla. Can you introduce yourself? Hi, Chris. <laughs> uh, my name is Jose Puebla from Fairway Mortgage. Uh -huh. uh, we are very excited to be here and hosting this webinar. We have so much going on. Uh, we would like to share a lot of information for you. Um, so keep tuned because our topic today is so interesting. Yes, so I'm super excited. Cash out refi. And I don't know how many of you uh, know, they have ever heard this uh, terms. It's a refi, right? Correct, it's but, a refinance. But what is the big difference? So basically, um, this is the, the, the beautiful part of it is how you can access your equity, mm -hmm. right? So the equity uh, for many people is, is an asset, mm -hmm. right? Is, is a gain of uh, some, some money in mm -hmm. your house, right? Mm -hmm. So the refinance is the ability to access to that equity. Mm -hmm. There's different options, different options to, to be able to access that. And we're gonna explain those uh, in a few minutes. And I'm glad that we have a lot of people joining wow. um, awesome. the webinar. But can Hi, Facebook user can access our uh, slide? Uh, I don't think so. But um, we're gonna share with you a link mm -hmm. of these. Uh, can we share that Zoom yeah. link to them? We're gonna share this link to you guys mm -hmm. so you can access to a presentation. It's a very cool presentation. Mm -hmm. So if you have the time, not only to be in Facebook, mm -hmm. but to join Zoom, it will be amazing. For, for you. Uh, it's gonna take, what, 30 minutes? Yeah, 20 minutes. Yeah, yeah. 20 to 30 minutes mm -hmm. at the most. Um, great information, cash out refinance, how to uh, invest in real estate, mm -hmm. how you use your equity, mm -hmm. and many other good topics, right? Yeah, up, yeah. up there, Look, under, under, yeah, there. Awesome. So. All right, guys, so we're gonna actually go ahead and share this right mm -hmm. now. Mm -hmm. There you go. Yeah, but don't worry. If you do not, you don't need actually see the slide. Uh, probably he can cover. Uh, you know, we can uh, give you the verbal explanation as much as we can too. Correct. Right? I mean, and also this uh, webinar will be recorded. Will be in YouTube as well. Oh yes. So if you don't have the time to be the entire twenty minutes right now with us, uh, this uh, presentation with the slides uh, will be in YouTube. So thank you for joining. Yeah, thanks for waiting too. I'm so sorry for the uh, little bit of delay. So topics today is a keyword, as you mentioned, refi, cash out refi. Is so this recording? Yes. Right. Um, make, sure. make sure recording. Yes, yeah, it is. Okay, All right, perfect. so perfect. Sorry about this. Uh, so, and as you mentioned, you mentioned equity, cash out refi, and down payment. Um, so there's, we, we are trying to talk about three different typical cases. Yes. When the client wants to consider cash out refi uh, instead of just typical traditional refi. Correct. So three cases, correct me if I'm wrong. Okay, you're the expert. So the, the client has a, a, a own a property, the first property, uh, but want to buy a second property for investment. Correct. Correct, right? And another case, uh, needs some uh, funding for uh, children's education, like a college fund. Correct. The third case scenario, uh, need some uh, funds, spare fund for the business operation. Correct, or just to launch a business. Great, mm -hmm. so yeah. so then, but this cash out refi can cover those yes. areas, right? Yes, correct. So right. as we said from the beginning, uh, the cash out refinance is basically an access to your equity, right? right. So there are many uh, stipulations from the banks to be able to access that equity. Mm -hmm. So there's limitations, right? Mm -hmm. um, I have this question uh, mm -hmm. yesterday from a client, uh, basically trying to get a HELOC. A HELOC means a mm -hmm. equity line of credit. Mm -hmm. That's what it means. 
Um, so we were talking about the options and he asked me, so how much equity can I access, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. So the answer is very simple. Your equity is the combination of two things. Mm -hmm. Is the money that you're paying mm -hmm. from your principal balance. Mm -hmm. So you're paying your monthly payments, right? Sure. Every month, every month. So you're reducing the balance every month. On top of that, mm -hmm. you have the market gain. Mm -hmm. So whatever, let's say you bought your house five years ago. Mm -hmm. From that period, period of time, uh, five years ago until now, mm -hmm. you have market gain. Sure. So your property is going up and up mm -hmm. and up in value. Mm -hmm. Plus whatever money you already pay your mm -hmm. principal, mm -hmm. that's the entire equity. Yes. Okay. So equity grows over it's time. Times. Yes. Okay. Yes. So the beautiful part is the ability to access to that equity. Great. So, and, and to be able to access 100% of your equity, mm -hmm. the only way mm -hmm. to access 100% of your equity mm -hmm. is selling the property. Correct. That was yeah, the answer yeah. to, my, to my client. Very easy. <laughs> yeah. yeah yes. So can, how can I access 100% of my equity? Well, very simple. You need to sell the property. Mm -hmm. Right. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, you have limitations. Mm -hmm. You can access up to 80%, sometimes 90% of your equity. Mm -hmm. uh, it depends on the bank in mm -hmm. this situation. Mm -hmm. So in this case, the first topic, um, we have this scenario where a client is planning to consolidate mm -hmm. many, many loans, mm -hmm. not only the first mortgage and other loans, mm -hmm. and also have enough money mm -hmm. to purchase a second property yeah yeah so, so investment most, most importantly uh i don't we don't want to give them you you guys a headache mm -hmm. all you have to remember is just why you heard oh i heard it right yes then all you have to remember is content information you jose yes. then you can reach out to them to you then you can give them a free consultation then right? as soon as uh, they are ready mm -hmm. we contact you chris sure to find the property yeah, yeah. right so, so that's the deal. Um, so it's very, we have this, uh, this way to say, it, do not disqualify yourself. I love that phrase. Yeah. I love that phrase. Don't disqualify yourself. What, what does you, that mean? <laughs> it's like you have, you have options. You right. don't have only one bank as an option. You have many, many options. Mm -hmm. Sometimes if one of the banks is not able to, to do the loan for you, it doesn't mean that you don't qualify. It also, what, what it means is then that bank mm -hmm. doesn't have the product available for mm -hmm. you mm -hmm. at that moment. So, and you have to have that many cases and, like that, right? Yes, yes. And we have failed in traditional bank, the customer end really uh, disappointed. Come to uh, Jose, can you help me? And yes. you help the customer, yes. right? Yes. So that, that so that, that what that means, right? Yes. Do not qualify yourself doesn't mean that you have no option. He may have an option through his company. Correct? Yes. Correct. Yes. Correct. So that's the, the, the beautiful part of, um, you know, taking some of your equity mm -hmm. to purchase a second property and the ability to consolidate everything. So we have a, we can create a plan for you. Everything is about the numbers, right? The sure. numbers has to make sense. Right. So if the numbers, if you have a benefit, and the benefit is higher than the mm -hmm. cost, mm -hmm. go ahead and do it. Sure. But not the opposite. Yeah. So the second one is a children education. You know, there are many people uh, in the States that the only strong asset is the house, Correct. right? Is the real estate. Mm -hmm. That's probably the only, they mm -hmm. don't have a college fund. They don't have a, even a retirement fund. Mm -hmm. So having this real estate with mm -hmm. equity, mm -hmm. Uh, and the ability to access to the equity mm -hmm. is, is a blast because mm -hmm. they, then they can actually uh, send the, the children to, to yeah. college in this case. Yeah, more importantly, they, ha they can have an option, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> to support yeah. the children that, if they want to, right? Correct. That's a beautiful example. Yes, and the last one is about business operations, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. So business owners, uh, if you own a house, you mm -hmm. want to inject more money into your business, to buy equipment or to just operation uh, or, yeah or mm -hmm. for operations or if you're planning to launch your own business mm -hmm. and you're in the stage number one mm -hmm. then yes an mm -hmm. equity mm -hmm. and access to your equity a cash mm -hmm. out refinance or mm -hmm. a just line of credit mm -hmm. is is 
is really helpful. Sure. Right? Yeah. Because it's not really it's not really difficult to qualify for. Mm -hmm. That's one. Mm -hmm. Second, it will be more uh, easy to access to that equity versus a, mm -hmm. an SBA loan. Mm -hmm. Right. Mm -hmm. Okay. So let's move. Uh, let me move to the next slide. Oh, the current August, uh, the current market Austin, the Austin area, the metropolitan area, the market is crazy. The Austin market, um, the inventory extremely low, and normally peak time is the summertime, as you as you may know. Uh, July is a peak, and August is supposed to be come down a little bit, but still the inventory is a 2.7 months only. The Austin area, metropolitan area, meaning is still a strong seller's market. So, uh, gosh, if there's an opportunity to buy a property, maybe this is a good opportunity, right? Yes, it is an amazing opportunity for uh, those folks that are watching us in another state, like Washington, for example. Mm -hmm. um, here, we still have ability to find houses below 300,000. Oh, yeah. Which is so weird for example, the state in Seattle. In Seattle? Yeah, like Seattle, there's nothing uh, below. 500,000? 400,000. 600,000. You really need to go really south or really north to be able to find something. But yes. um, yeah, I, I was talking with a client this morning and they want to buy a property for 230,000. Yes. And it's like we have those prices still here. Yeah, in, yeah, yeah. In, in uh, Austin uh, area. But it's amazing how it's growing. Yeah, it's yes. Really fast. Yeah, I'm talking about the medium. So, but a lot of uh, affordable options in Williams County area, other county, uh, in the suburb area too. So, um, so interest rates and historically very low, yes. correct? Yes. So, you will always have a question from the customer client that, oh, Jose, also uh, a lot of questions. Is it a good time to buy a house? Yes. And your opinion is? It is. It is. You know, the answer of that question, when is a good time to buy a house mm -hmm. today? Today is, is the, if you're ready to purchase a house today, mm -hmm. do it. Because um, there's ups and downs, right? Mm -hmm. Yes, ups in, and downs. In, in, in real estate. But if you're looking as a long-term investment, there's always a benefit. Mm -hmm. There's always a benefit. So, and in, in regards of interest rate, we still low historically low we're extremely we, low we have a graphic here then uh, it shows then 1982 double, double digits <laughs> in 1981 1980s in the 80s let's say in the 80s oh father we, generation yeah. we are we were what 60 uh, percent it's crazy 18 18 percent amazing and then people you know bought houses back there um with no problems and still you know i before this, uh, we launched this, we were talking about that mm -hmm. in South America, mm -hmm. uh, there are interest rates with two digits. It's really Like wow. 10% it's or crazy. 11%. It's crazy. Yeah, I don't know how they do it, but oh. they do it. Um, so very low interest rate, good prices. Mm -hmm. I think the only negative thing is that mm -hmm. low inventory, so. Yeah, low inventory. But you know, uh, it, the statistics show, keep showing that inventory, is is no better over times so why wait that's yes. the purpose so if you're living in austin area and still better than washington yes. <laughs> seattle <laughs> okay six hundred thousand but you, you okay three hundred four hundred thousand here really beautiful house three hundred thousand williams county still you can buy some options now if you're in seattle and you want to invest here in, in austin do it do it because it's, it's amazing mm -hmm. how you can actually profit from, mm -hmm. from the investment. Yes. So contact Chris for, for any investment problem. So pretty cool. Very good. Very good comparison. So a little bit specific. Uh, we talk about three. Oh, no. We talk about uh, the bank cases. The client come to you. He has an option. So that's why you, do, mm -hmm. you always keep educating your client. Do not disqualify yourself, right? Correct. So Correct. keep that in mind. If you heard something, any negative <laughs> feedback from your uh, the bank, doesn't mean that they have no option, correct? Correct, correct. And, and here's the problem, you know, many, many bankers or many loan officers uh, in the banks um, know everyone, okay? Mm -hmm. 
I'm not talking about any specific bank or anything like that, but mm -hmm. sometimes they're, they're new people, mm -hmm. okay? And they don't know everything about the programs. Mm -hmm. uh, they don't go a, a, an extra mile mm -hmm. to educate themselves and also to be able to educate a client mm -hmm. um, for all the possibilities. Mm -hmm. So uh, do a little bit more of homework uh, and, and try to find out what else is out there, right? Mm -hmm. um, I mean, there are programs uh, right now that you can do bank statements mm -hmm. uh, for business owners. You can do um, basically no income verifications for mm -hmm. some folks. Mm -hmm. I really don't recommend those programs unless you need it, mm -hmm. right? Uh, but just explore your options. That's exactly my point. Mm -hmm. Explore your options. Don't give up in saying, saying oh, I don't qualify. There are options, mm -hmm. but just dig a little bit sure. more into this. So my understanding from the traditional banker, they have a few options, and they do uh, easier uh, loan options, but some difficult cases. Uh, you may have a, still you have a chance through uh, somebody like some other company like uh, Jose can find the opportunity, correct. the best option for your current situation, correct? Correct. So correct. It's, it's like we explained this uh, many times. A bank is like a box, right? Mm -hmm. In a square box. If you don't fit in that box, they will say, no, I'm sorry, you don't qualify. Mm -hmm. But being with a, even a broker or a direct lender like ourselves, mm -hmm. uh, bigger box. we have a bigger box or too many boxes, mm -hmm. many options, mm -hmm. right? We can do, uh, we are Fannie Mae, Freddie Mac direct lenders, but we have also the ability to broker out mm -hmm. with another programs, mm -hmm. right? Um, the, the sky is the limit. Great. So, um, yeah, so for the specific cash RE5, we mentioned about three uh, distinctive uh, case, uh, cases like buying a second property. Mm -hmm. So let's talk about in detail. So uh, like a client wants to have a own property, first property, but buying a second property, but down payment uh, limit funding uh, situation. Correct. So Correct. it's a good good case. It is a good case. Uh, mm -hmm. You access your equity uh, uh, from your pr uh, principal residence, mm -hmm. then you start investing. Mm -hmm. uh, you use that part of the equity and invest in a second property. Mm -hmm. And then for the third property, then you have a cash flow, mm -hmm. positive cash flow because you have a rental property. Mm -hmm. I mean, there, there is a plan, there is a blueprint that we play, uh, put in place for, for you guys. Uh, but yes, it is a good benefit. So this tool is help you to be a, a investor mm -hmm. uh, down the road. Correct. So very good uh, the case. The second case we talk about college fund is the college tuition is extremely high in the United States, unfortunate. But this is to give them, give us a good option Yes. To support our children if we want, right? Yes. And uh, I will do a parenthesis here. Uh, we do have actually programs mm -hmm. where we can educate our clients, mm -hmm. our consumers, in terms of debt. Mm -hmm. uh, it's not something that is going to, uh, it, it is like a system, okay? Mm -hmm. Basically, it is a system that you put in place to pay less interest mm -hmm. and be able to invest mm -hmm. in real estate. It's a very specific great. program for, for like a debt elimination, but it's not, nothing related with debt consolidation or anything like that. So it's basically a system that we put in place to be able to help our clients to eliminate yeah. debt. Again, you don't need to remember everything. Mm -hmm. Just once you were heard it, oh, I heard it. Then that's enough. Then all you have to do is to contact Jose or me. We will help you, right? Yes, absolutely. So, and remember, for those folks that are just joining us, um, we are putting this video on YouTube, so keep tuned and you will and see the this Facebook as well yeah. later. And then um, also uh, the self-employed, the business owner, yes. they need some uh, funds sometimes they for the business operation. Yes, and, and in this case for business owners, uh, many of the business owners, uh, they don't have enough Cash. Um, money mm -hmm. to actually, to apply for a loan, mm -hmm. right? Because mm -hmm. they don't declare you know, all, all, mm -hmm. all the income. Uh, that's one of the challenges for mm -hmm. many business owners. Mm -hmm. We do have different programs where we can help the business owners not only mm -hmm. to access to the first 
first home, mm -hmm. also to access the equity they already gained. Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. so we have this ability to to strategize either a line of credit or a cash out refinance, mm -hmm. and you can use that money to boost your your business mm -hmm. or to start your, your own business. Yes. So we have the ability yes. to do that. So yeah, this is a really beautiful three examples. Um, and uh, as we mentioned earlier, uh, different than the typical bank and uh, Jose, a fairway company, it has uh, many, many options. Yes. So you can check all the boxes over the table, whether it's the best option for individual, the client, yes. the cases. And you can, you can choose the best option Correct. Uh, uh, themselves. I will do a, uh, another quick introduction. Uh, Chris is a real estate agent here in Austin mm -hmm. area. Um, you want to talk a little bit more about what you do, how many uh, time do you have in business and all that? Yeah, so I've been in the industry more than five, six years since 2014 and Austin alone. So I know the Austin market very well. Mm -hmm. uh, Bookshare is a top, uh, top tier the, uh, broker company. And uh, as I said, I'm really privileged here, working here, the Austin is great market. But as I said, don't disqualify yourself. Yes. As a, we can team up, uh, we will ready for you. Just reach out to us, simple question, and it's free consultation. It's already, always provided to over the phone. Uh, we can do face-to-face -face -face meeting if yes. in case uh, we are near here, we can do uh, chat over the coffee shop yes. if necessary, right? Yep, so absolutely. not a problem, just ask for it and get the consultation and you can decide later. I mean, if, uh, once you heard, oh, this is a good option, you can, you can take it. Or if not necessary, I mean, you can just leave it. I mean, just if not really match to your criteria. Yes. Uh, sometimes they say the information and knowledge is power, mm -hmm. but using the knowledge is much better. Mm -hmm. sure. It's powerful. Yeah. So uh, my, uh, Myself, uh, Jose Luis Puebla from Fairway Mortgage. I'm in the business for 15 years. Licensed here in Texas State and also in Washington State. Mm -hmm. um, so we do have many options for you guys. Uh, in our company, we are Fannie Mae, Freddie Mac, Jimmy Mae, UX lenders. Mm -hmm. What that means, it sounds like so weird, but it means that we have access to all those programs. Yeah, all Fannie options. Mae, Freddie Mac. <laughs> yes, many options. So we have in our um, the slide here, we do have conventional loans, FHA, BAs, USDA programs, DPAs, which is the down payment assistance program, zero down payment, mm -hmm. um, DACA files uh, or DACA visas or, or permits, and also in non-QM programs, which is uh, bank statement. outside of the box programs mm -hmm. with bank statements, foreign mm -hmm. nationals, and another kind of uh, programs uh, with uh, unconventional profiles. So that's what we do. Sure. And uh, that's why we are sharing this information for all of you. Mm -hmm. And uh, we're really happy to, you know, share all Yeah, this let's bring out a brief example of your, uh, through your customer, that uh, self-employed, mm -hmm. uh, they qualify for the conventional loan, a uh, little bit less target uh, the fund for the loan, but the bank statement loan. Yes. Uh, like, uh, let's say 300,000 uh, amount like uh, the loan plus down payment. So it, he's not happy with the solution, but with the bank statement loan through your assessment, he can qualify like 400,000. Correct, correct. We did that, um, this is our case, mm -hmm. uh, life case scenario. Um, this client was trying to find a house for 400,000 mm -hmm. in that range. And um, unfortunately with the traditional documentation which is you know tax mm -hmm. returns pay stubs yes. or if he's a business owner uh profit and loss statements uh, there's no way because mm -hmm. you know on the on the tax return it shows yes. an amount but if we, if we go with bank statements um it's different world mm -hmm. different ways to see the income so it's based on your deposits and and we have a, a specific calculator to analyze that income mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. so we went from 300,000 all the way to 400,000 exactly. qualifications. Yes. Um, so sexual story, we closed the deal. Now the, the, the client is in his house and he's yeah, happy, I guess. That's what, whatever he wants. That, so basically he has a two options, both options. He can choose, but a traditional way, traditional banker has only a one option 
it had to just you know, tie to the only one single option. So that's a basically what and what we said in the beginning. Uh, this the, the first bank was a preferred lender. Mm -hmm. uh, the house was actually a new construction. So the preferred lender, they really tried really hard <laughs> to put this. Actually, they failed. These together, um, they couldn't, right? They couldn't. Uh, they don't have experiences. It. Because the same thing that we, we discuss, uh, we talk, um, they don't have enough experience. They're, they don't know how this non-QM works and, mm -hmm. and, and it requires a lot of time and a lot of things around. So you need to be prepared for that and you need to work really hard to make They've it They've been happen. doing a lot of uh, easy loans more, so. Order takers. Yeah, so the difficult loans. So, but as, a, as I said, he has more options. That is a key message today. Right? Yes, yes. So all, every option on, on the table for the clients. Absolutely. Absolutely. That's a key message. So, uh, yeah, if you type out any of the question, if you have right now, you can type here, then he will answer, I will answer uh, here. But if not, then don't worry. We're gonna post our contact information here in Facebook after this session. Yes. And uh, uh, YouTube later, uh, both his account and my account. So uh, I think we are uh, searchable Google. Uh, it put your uh, his name and my name, and then. Uh, but after this session, we will guarantee we'll put our contact information right here. Yes, uh, you, you will see this uh, video uh, mm -hmm. uploaded in YouTube. So right now we want to open uh, for all the questions. We want to open this uh, for for any questions you have. Um, I know that we have many people here. Yeah, thanks for uh, joining. Yes, thank you so much, guys. I really appreciate that you're joining. Uh, this information is is critical because uh, options are uh, the key in this market. Mm -hmm. And if you're if you really want to compete and you really want to win a, an offer, you have to have someone in your back, a really sure. good real estate agent, mm -hmm. a really good uh, loan officer mm -hmm. who can put together. A really nice plan for you, um, and again, uh, all this information um, is available. Uh, we're launching all these webinars. This is our, actually our third webinar or fourth. Yeah. So yeah, fourth. Yeah. Yeah. Fourth. We we have more information. Uh, mm -hmm. You can Google us, uh, Chris and mm -hmm. and Jose Puebla. Yeah. Um, thank you so much for joining. Uh, thank you so much. Oh, do you see, have a question? Let, no. Let's see. You guys have any questions? Yeah. Um, we have more time available, mm -hmm. so uh, let me share these. Um, yeah, I think we have a question. But it's awesome! I mean, so many people yes. uh, uh, pay attention to. And thank you, guys. Thank you. Thank you so much. All right, so we're gonna close. Uh, if we we don't have any other questions. Uh, again, this was. Uh, this webinar was regarding cash out refinance and all the benefits. Mm -hmm. And thank you, everyone, for joining. Thank you. Thank you, guys.